Okay, next up on our CBC Spring Sports Media Day, we have the Edgewood Boys tennis team. I'm going to let the guys introduce themselves, and then we'll jump into some questions for them. So, guys, introduce yourself. Name, grade, and uh, what uh, first singles, second singles, that type of thing. What 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 uh, level you plan to play at? What do we say for our position? I don't even know what I'd say first. Second and third. All right. Uh, my name is Robert DiGiacomo. I am a senior, and I play second singles. Uh, I'm Vinny DeGeorge. Uh, I'm also a senior, and I play third singles. All right, so Robert, I'll start with you. Just coming in, obviously you're a senior, so coming in, you got to be pretty excited about that. Uh, you know, at the same time, every time you play, though, your your career's coming to an end. So how are you kind of battling with those dueling emotions? Um, it is. It's pretty like I feel like it's not really hitting me yet. I'm like, wow, like this is really the end of you know my last tennis season. But I feel like I'm just kind of trying to stay calm and keep my head in the game and just have fun with what I'm doing and just enjoy it, really, and not focus on that because we have – we're looking at the most successful season in our school's history. So, you know, there's a lot to have fun with there and, you know, want to just be a good role model and go out with a bang. What leads you to believe that this could be that, uh, you know, really good season? Because I know <laughs> – I, I mean, it's just going to be. There's – I don't really know. There isn't really anything that leads me to believe that. I just know that it's going to happen. You know, we're going to be good. We're going to – we have a lot of goals that we plan on reaching, and we have a lot of good players on the team for the first time in what must be a really long time. All right, so coming in, what kind of success have you had uh, coming into senior year? Well, me and this dude, Vinny, right here, we went to districts and doubles last year for – um, one of the first time in our school's history. We're not sure if it's the first or what, but it's definitely one of the first times that we've done that. And I got the CVC at second singles last year. Outstanding. All right. So how different is it playing doubles compared to singles? Oh, uh, it's it's way different. Singles and doubles are completely different games. I feel like doubles players deserve a lot more respect. Um you know, I feel like sometimes they may get overlooked to the singles players, but playing doubles is definitely just a completely different game, and it takes a it takes a lot of skill to be able to play doubles as well as singles. All right, give me a, a shout-out to some of your teammates. Who are the guys on the team that you think are going to have a big year? Guys on the team that are going to have a big year are all seven positions. That goes from Noah, me, Vinny, and then we have our first doubles, which I think is going to be – Carter Howard and Brady Vensel, and then our second doubles, Evan Ranson and Nick DeFazio. We're looking – we have a lot of goals, but I think that we're hoping to get a CBC championship for all five positions this year and, you know, maybe even the county championship and just win across the board as much as possible. Outstanding. Good luck to you this spring. All right, Vinny, on to you and third third singles. So coming in, you were doubles last year, uh, singles this year. How different is it for you just to kind of prepare to get ready for the season? Um, well, I played singles last year, too. Oh, okay. So he, uh, Robert but, had mentioned you had played doubles with him. So, okay. Oh, yeah. Well, that was for um, for when we went to um, – to sectionals we played it we decided to team up and play doubles instead of singles for a sectional tournament but in the regular season we play singles gotcha okay so you're, you're used to that preparation then so coming in as a senior though I mean obviously you've probably got some goals for yourself what did you do to prepare for this year just to make it a great way to go out uh just a lot of um training in the off season like you know going to Lots of different places offer like classes during the winter because you can't play outside. So you can go indoors, play indoors and then conditioning, going to the gym and making sure my body's in the best shape and watching videos, uh, just trying to learn as much as I can and try to get like as much of an edge as I can um, during the off season. Robert mentioned that he thinks it's going to be a, a great year for Edgewood. From your perspective, why do you think that's going to be true? I think that that's going to be true because I just think we have some of the best players in the county and the CVC and everything. I think that uh, everyone on our team has worked really hard to get to where they are. So, you know, I think this is finally our year, all of us seniors, to really show what we've worked so hard towards. What are your goals for this year individually and for your team? Um, I'd say 
win the CVC championship, win the county tournament, you know, kind of like he said, just win as much as possible. Um, we made it to districts last year after sectionals, so maybe to make it past districts, make it to the state championship would be, you know, an amazing goal. You know, it's a it's a big goal, but I think that we can do it. All right, and last one for you is same thing. Who's a, a breakout player? Somebody you thinks going to have a great year this spring. Um, I do think everyone will have a great season. If there's, you know, I will say that I've seen Noah Vensel improve so much over the years. Uh, he's a year younger than us, but I still learn things from his game every single time that we play. He's, I haven't seen anybody improve like I've seen him improve and. He's playing first single. He played first singles for our um, our last match against NBCL. Looked super calm and composed. Got the win, not easily, but you know without too much struggle. And I just think that he's a great player. He's gonna have a great season. Outstanding. All right, gentlemen. Well, I appreciate you taking some time out of your day to preview the season. And uh, best of luck to you. Thank you. Thank you.